So I'm now heading out to the city. Hey, I just had a very good call with my advisor Izat. Now I'm heading to heading to Nairobi. How is your has your day been so far? Yeah. Okay. Hi, Ali. Hey, thank you. Okay, Moses. Yeah. What do you think? How was the meetings? Ah, the meetings were uh, quite. Uh, the meeting were, were, were quite great. I think we've been able to learn more from uh, those two meetings. One with the director at uh, Yali Innovation and Incubation Center, and also with the chief of party uh, for Yali in the Eastern and Central Region. Yeah, so the meeting was one hour. Yeah, I mean, so we spoke first with uh, the director for the entire East Africa Young African Leadership Initiative. So that's for context, I was uh, Barack Obama initiated um, and it is uh, sponsored by USAID. Yeah. So we spoke with their director. I presented what we do uh, with, uh, with our with my pitch, so to speak, and it was very, very. I mean, happy to to hear about all of the design decisions, in particular with my economics background. For example, that we give money to the students or vouchers to the students that they can use to hire tutors, so they pay for the tutors. So we don't. Uh, we are not actually hiring the tutors, paying them like a monthly salary. Instead, they get incentives to do their best because otherwise the tutor the students are not going to choose them so it's performance based um, that's just one of the examples and also the fact that uh, coding or at least if you're a remote coder that's an export industry so from an economic growth point of view this is extremely important uh, and also our industry linkages like our ambition at least to partner with tech companies and find them jobs so all of these things i think appeal to him um, and we got introduced to the lead of partnerships at Yali and she was also happened to have a background in education so she was very passionate yeah, like yeah. very excited about yeah. helping young talents uh, get the skills needed and and upskilling so she was happy to like introduce us to uh, whatever we would need uh, I guess uh, and then we spoke lastly with the the what was that industry linkages yeah, yeah. the industry and linkages uh innovation uh director director at the yeah. kenyatta university exactly and then yeah. we had a very long talk actually with him yeah, and he had many uh, questions yeah. and that we answered and then we went back and forth in terms of how to go forward uh, because our idea is to have a certificate issued by kenyatta university uh, jointly with directors for the 10-week boot camp because that gives a bit of more credibility and also it helps students who are talented but who otherwise would go into like something more traditional like medicine or lawyer law uh, to venture into this alternative path um, because that's really what we want we want to get these top top students who might have good other options to to dare to take this route non-traditional way because you wouldn't get a degree from this uh, not initially maybe maybe eventually they, they can like you know, also also get a degree but but the plan is to offer an alternative route to employment and to you know producing value on the market a faster way um, and that's because that's important uh, students want some form of official recognition and Kenyatta is the is that is it the number one university uh, uh, in the country? Yeah. The top three. One top three. Yeah, I mean it's always hard. They always compete and yeah. have their specialities, but it is a top three university, very well recognized. Um, so we now are we're now initiating this. Uh, it will take some time, but uh, I am very positive. And now we're gonna have lunch before going to Power Learn Project, which is another big uh, organization. Uh, and their graduation ceremony. Uh, so I'll keep you updated on that. How much is this? 660. So it's uh, three, but, but that's 30. for two of us. 280 yeah. per person. 280 per person, yeah. So that's like two, two, oh, no way. Yeah, it's uh, two dollars something. Uh, two dollars, yeah. Two dollars, a bit more than two dollars. Yeah. Oh, very nice. So this is the school food. Yeah, yeah. And a lot of food as well. But more for, for the staff. Ah, uh, so staff. Yeah, because it's a restaurant.
uh, professional documents with me, which are generated from the curriculum design. So we have the skills of work, lesson plans, assessment records, and record of work. <laughs> Okay, thank you for driving me. It's fucking what three three oh five a.m. Yeah. We were out in Nairobi just three hours ago. Three hours ago. Basically, yeah. We were very VIP today. Exactly. We yeah. went through the Nairobi festivals. We had an honor of actually uh, being in the VIP section. Yeah, yeah, which is quite amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got to meet a lot of cool people. Yeah. Uh, Hassan Sarah, my Hassan, new friend. Yeah, Hassan Sarah, she's an actor. Actress. Uh, we also met Kwamboka, she's a journalist. Uh, we also met... Um, a DJ, uh, well, the, no, no, the, the MC, minister, MC. Uh, the, C, the CC. The youngest we, minister, right? Exactly, yeah, we also got to meet uh, Calligraph Jones. Yep. And yeah. got to watch some Morocco versus uh, France, France, getting yeah. their ass kicked, uh, but in a very high security. I've never seen that many like <laughs> yeah. big boys with guns, like watching me watching football. Exactly, it's <laughs> like literally like 10, 15 armed guards, yeah. like military. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I also wanted a quick recap of uh, meetings today. So we went to Yali uh, at Kenyatta University and had a very good talk with uh, both the uh, regional Yali lead for East Africa, Dr. George, Dr. George and the partnerships uh, um, deputy and the director for innovation and industry linkages, I think. Yeah, Professor Omaina. Professor Omaina, yes, that was very nice. So we have some pictures there. And then after that is when we went to the uh, graduation ceremony of PowerLearn projects at the KICC, KICC, yeah. KICC in the central Nairobi, uh, listening to their pitches and you know celebrating their graduation together with with, with everyone there and, and these these you know influencers basically. Yeah. And then it was the kind of watching football. Yeah. And then it was go home, pack, <laughs> and then what? Well, get up to the airport.